He is one of the biggest stars on daytime television, and this week Eric Braden is celebrating his 40th anniversary on the CBS hit soap opera, The Young and the Restless. We sat down with Eric recently to talk about his four decades on the show as Victor Newman. When you first started on, on, on Young and the Restless, did you ever in your, in your wildest dreams think you'd, you'd be doing this? No. I signed for three months. And after three months, I didn't want it anymore. And uh, they talked me into extending the contract. I did. And uh, the rest is history. I mean, because the name Victor Newman is almost as famous as Eric Braden. Yeah, well, more so right now, I think. Really, you think? Oh, in many ways, yeah. You know, but I mean, I'm Eric Braden, but uh, yeah, been very lucky. Long run, wonderful run, and uh, ups and downs, but uh, very grateful. You've seen so many people come and go on that show, oh, yeah. and you have been really the, the I mean, it's almost the stability of, of Young and the Restless. Right. We had recently a producer, an executive producer, who uh, is no longer with us, thank God. He tried to change all that. I said, who the hell are you to come here from somewhere else and want to change what has been successful for, in this case, 39 years, but we had number one for 30 or 31 years now, number one. That's unprecedented in Hollywood. And did they change it? No, no, no. They got rid of him. <laughs> yeah. And you guys carry a lot of clout on the show. I mean, I mean, you ca I can't imagine the Young and the Restless without Eric Braden. Well, that's very nice to know. And um, I have never bought into that because when an actor starts thinking that without him something doesn't work, then you're in trouble, big trouble. However, you don't want to undersell yourself either. No, 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 no. But just you know, let the facts speak for themselves. And, and uh, you know, and when I was on the set, because I, I'm, I'm friends with Christian LeBlanc, he's right. from here. He's a wonderful actor. He is a wonderful actor. He's a damn he really good actor. is. And, and he and I, when we do scenes together, got to be careful because it always turns into laughter, you know. And that's, but that's the one thing I did notice, and I was going to say about that, because he's a jokester, oh, yeah. and you're a jokester. <laughs> anyway, so it's dangerous working with him, or Dougie Davidson for that matter. We just laugh all the because you look at the whole thing and. You know, sometimes it, it, what am I saying? You know, it's, 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 anyway. <laughs> you're, you're, a, it's it, almost like a soap opera. Christian LeBlanc is a very good actor and a uh, nice guy, very nice guy. And, uh, you know, and uh, I've said this to him and to you before, I mean, working on, on a, a, a soap like this right. is some of the hardest acting an actor will ever oh, do. Yeah. Oh, yeah, because we often shoot two or three shows on one day. It's the fastest medium in the world. We shoot over 100 pages a day. And nighttime television shoots between 8 and 12 pages a day. A film like Titanic shoots about 2 or 3 pages a day. And, and how much of Eric Braden is in Victor Newman? And how much of Victor Newman is in Eric? And Victor Newman is not in me at all. At all. I, just, I dismiss it. As soon as I'm finished with it, it's gone. It's, I am who I am. And... Um, so a lot of what I am and my experiences obviously bleed into the character. It's inevitable. And because in a long running soap like this, you need to draw from within yourself, you know? Now, there are many things I absolutely would not do that I've always shunned in the character, but that's when acting comes in. You know, I would never have a bad relationship with my uh, children or grandchildren, and I would not. And, um, would not do certain things. Not interested, that interested in business. Do you think you'll ever give it up? No. 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 I will, uh, the word retirement, I don't like it at all. So, you know? so you'll, you'll stop being Victor Newman when they carry you out of there? Uh, probably. Yeah. Probably. But unless the show stops before, you know. But I will, why would I? I mean, if, I'm so lucky as an actor to have found a role that is really very satisfying um, to do, and I'm successful at it, and if that's the case, stick with it. 
He is such a cool guy. You can, of course, watch the Young and the Restless weekdays at 11 o'clock in the morning on Channel 4, right before the noon news. And uh, it's a special episode for Eric Braden's 40th anniversary. It starts airing today on the show on the Young and the Restless.